Some and any. What's, What's the, the difference? difference? Let's find out. Hello. Hi, Phil. Hi. How are you? Where are you? I'm. I'm at the supermarket. I can't really talk right now. Oh, great! I just opened the fridge and it's depressing. We don't have anything. So, can you please get some milk? Yes, I've got I've got some milk in and my basket. Okay, perfect. And uh, we don't have any of those chocolate biscuits that I really, really like. Can you get me some, please? You want some chocolate biscuits, but you've already had loads of chocolate biscuits. No, Bis I haven't had any chocolate biscuits in the last 24 hours, so... Can you please? Okay, I'll get you some chocolate biscuits. Thank you. Anything uh, else? Do we have any any fruit? Fruit? Yeah, look, I've got some bananas and I've got some apples. I've got some pasta. I've got some toilet roll. Um, I've got some potatoes. Okay. Um, I've got some rice. Mm. Um, Did got... you get any tomato sauce? For the... No, I haven't. I've got... Uh... I'm in the queue now, so I mean... Do we have any eggs? No, we don't have any eggs. Anything else? If I can think of something, then I'll call you back, okay? And you can go back in the queue. Okay, thank okay, you. All thank right. Thank you. Okay, Ciao. bye, bye. Can you wait there a moment? I'm just, I need to get some tomato sauce. Oh, hurry up. Okay, so some and any. We get very, very confused, Philip. ¿Cuándo se usa some? Bueno, some se usa normalmente en frases positivas. Por ejemplo, tengo huevos o tengo algunos huevos. ¿Cómo lo traducirías? Uf, esta frase es <laughs> un poco. Eh, diría, I have some eggs, ¿no? Porque es un, una frase afirmativa. I have yes. some eggs. I have some eggs. También para pedir algo, por ejemplo, ¿puedo tener o me puedes dar algo de información? Can I have some information? Or can, can you have... give me some information? Can I have some information? Or can you give me some information? También puedes usarlo para ofrecer algo. Por ejemplo, ¿quieres algo de comer? ¿Cómo lo traducirías? Uh, you will say, would you like some food? Would no. you like some food? ¿Quieres algo de comer? ¿Quieres algo de comida? ¿No? Mm -hmm. Ok. And when do you use any? Any se usa para preguntas. ¿Tenemos leche, por ejemplo? Ok. Do we have any milk? Do we have any milk? También se usa para frases negativas, ¿vale? Por ejemplo, no tengo nada de dinero. In English, ¿cómo lo traducirías? I don't have any money. I don't have any money. Yes. I don't have any money. Not, I don't have no money. Or nothing. No se puede tener dos palabras negativas in English. I don't have any money. ¿Ok? También any puede significar cualquiera. Por ejemplo, cualquiera de estas pastillas te ayudará. In English? Okay. So you'll say any of these pills will help you. Bueno, hemos visto que some es siempre para positive, ¿no? Afirmativo. Any, negativo. Some solamente es cuando pides algo u ofreces algo. Si es cualquier otro tipo de pregunta, se usa any, siempre. Ok, entonces, Isabel, vamos a practicar un poco, ¿vale? Uh. Lo has metido allí. Poc, poc. Está vacío. Hopefully. Entonces, Isabel, ¿cómo dirías uh, hay leche en la nevera? There is some milk in the fridge. Sí, porque es una frase positiva. ¿Y cómo dirías no hay nada de leche en la nevera? There isn't any milk in the fridge. Eso es. Una frase útil para los estudiantes que no quieren que sus madres sepan de los deberes Uh, mamá, el profesor no nos dio nada de deberes hoy. <laughs> so I'll say, mom, the teacher didn't give us any homework today. Yeah. He didn't give us anything. Nothing at all. En inglés se dice, no nos dio algo. ¿No? Sí. 
o nos dio nada. He gave us nothing. Yes. Y Isabel, ¿cómo traducirías? ¿Puedes poner un poco de azúcar en mi té, por favor? Uh, can you put some sugar in my tea? Can you put some sugar in my tea? Please. Please, sorry. <laughs> no necesito nada de azúcar, gracias. I don't need any sugar, thank you. Mm -hmm. ¿Y cómo traducirías? ¿Tenemos azúcar? Do we have any sugar? At home, ¿no? Uh -huh. Estoy preguntando, no te estoy pidiendo, ¿no? Y si te estuviera diciendo, ¿tienes azúcar para, para el té? En ese caso dirías, can I have some sugar? It's much better now. I think I understood, finally, after all those years. Thanks for watching this video. We'll see you next week. Leave us a comment, give us a like, subscribe, come and visit our website, and we'll see you soon. Ciao, ciao! Bye! Mwah. Can I have some of your bananas? Yes, you can have one banana. Any of them? Can I choose any of them? You can have the small one. Would you like some? I don't want any. Mm. Is it good? Mm. Can I have some time to eat it while... Are there any films on tonight?